Welcome back to another match of few here. I'm with defeated Hamilton 2-0 and um Yeah, I mean it's three points, we break the record, that's all good in the hood, but I mean it should be more. We should be tanking them, especially you know what I mean when we go 2-0 up that early on, but I mean I guess it's three points and you know what, we haven't conceded a goal this season so I guess there's not really too many things <laughs> to argue from that point. And I mean if you compare this to the Livingston game, obviously Hamilton went more attacking so fair play to them but I mean even that, I say fair play to them, it's, like, it's still like you go 2-0 down then, what do you do? I mean they had a string of corners in the second half but nothing spectacular from them but in terms of us, Itton's out so Haji came in. Um, in the play, well not in the place of Itton like but they had to reshuffle the team a bit, so it ends out for a couple of weeks, calf injury or some shit like that. But it was Hadji that picked up the first goal, lovely cross in by Davis, comes up, it's saved onto the bar, and there's like three of them in there, Hadji's the one that gets the final touch in, so it's good for him. Good confidence butcher, butcher, booster in that region. There's a couple of other chances, I mean, Tav and Barisic were literally playing as left forward and right forward, which is, um, Mental. Then the second goal came, Ryan Kent showing why he's the man. Hands off, Leeds United, you know what I mean? Fucking lovely bit of skill, gets past his man, shoots, ball falls to Tav, tap in, very similar to um the first goal. And then it kind of just went backwards from here, you know what I mean? There wasn't exactly an awful lot going, you know what I mean? There was more chances, there was a lovely bit of play, 1-2 with uh, Kent and Haji that almost went in. But there is one thing, or there is one player in particular I've got to talk about today, and it's the new signing Roof. Let's not lie here. He was fucking dog shit. Now, I, I, I totally understand starting him, because I don't think Morello should be starting, just due to the fact that the he's more playing him for himself than the club. You know what I mean? But, I mean... This was the type of game here where if I think we brought Morelos on about the 60th minute he would have got a couple of goals. Honestly, I, I do reckon that. It just seemed like his type of game. Roof was getting all these headers and he was just... All of them just seemed like... His first touch was letting him down. I mean, there was an incident where he gets shoved and then the referee's like, no, you shoved him. And it's like, no, he didn't. No, I mean, he just... <laughs> Nothing, nothing like that went down. I mean, I don't know what the ref. I mean, the refs are a joke. You know what I mean? But in terms of that, then you've also got a counting the fact you've got Andy Walker on see see Ian Crocker and Andy Walker on commentary, like especially Andy. Oh man, like can they get McCoy back on? You know what I mean? Like see on BT, like 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 for the past couple of seasons, you used to have like the normal guy. Like the not the play by play commentator, then you had like McCoy and Sutton, you know what I mean? And that was a brilliant dynamic. But see now, oh man, well I say see now, but these these two have always done the Scotland games or the Scottish games, you know what I mean? And it's just brutal to watch. But I mean I don't want got a man sent off. We didn't make any subs to late on, but to me, Manelos would have thrived in this game, you know what I mean? But yeah, I mean I think using them as a super sub is brilliant, to be honest. Cause you know what I mean? It, it'll make him hungry for it. Because due to the fact he's not starting, he's like, I need to prove a point, get this move away instead of starting games. He's like, oh, I'm comfortable, I'm the starting man for Rangers. Nobody's getting my place, big man. But yeah, 2 0, not much more to say about it. We break the record, it's great. It's another win, it's another clean sheet, but it was a bit of a lacklustre performance. I mean, much better than the one against Livingston. But once we got our two goals, it was kind of pack, take the ball and go home as Stone Cold Steve Austin did about 18 years ago, but until next time, peace.